tonight we're using the Poltero. I um, haven't used this deck before, but I like it. What I want to know is um, the Crazy Plain Lady. I just saw a um, news clip that she just released an apology for acting crazy. So I'm sus about it. I feel like <clears throat> I don't want to put any energy into it. But what I do want to do is check um, the cards and see what the cards say. What I want to know is, first of all, was this plain lady's apology her own idea? Was she coerced? Was this someone else's idea? Was it something that um, maybe she was forced to say? Um, those are the kinds of questions that I have because I feel like it's just a little too suspicious that she's coming out here and she's saying that she was crazy or something. I don't know. I only watched the part of the clip. It's on Law & Order. Um, if you guys want to go check it out. And the clip said that the crazy plain lady apologized on TikTok for speaking out of turn. So what I want to ask the cards, and like I said, I'm using a new deck tonight. I might switch back to my regular ones. Um, but I want to know if the crazy plain lady's um, apology was her own idea. That's how we'll start it. We'll just start. Was the crazy plain lady's apology, okay, the cards are ready, her own idea, or was it coerced? Was the crazy plain lady's apology her own idea, or was she, okay, was it her own idea? One question. Was the crazy plain lady's apology her own idea? Reading's over. <laughs> and the underlying energy is the Seven of Cups. Well, well, I guess um, <laughs> doesn't take a card reader to tell you that the first card we pulled, um, the World in Reverse, and Two of Wands. Okay. So, um, and we have the tower as the next underlying, and absolutely not. This was absolutely not her idea. She did not come up with that idea. She did not want to say that. Um, temperance, okay, like, I don't even know where to start with this. The answer is no. She did not come up with this idea. This was definitely coerced, definitely made to do it. I mean, you can't even, like... I couldn't have been, oh, of course, no, this was not her idea. She definitely was coerced. The moon, um, major arcana, so that's a shadow, that's a secret. That means, like, <laughs> not in the light. The only card we could have gotten that would have been even more telling would have been the high priestess. Then we have the ace of wands. Anything with, <laughs> this was, like, also, you better do it right now. Not only... Are we going to tell you what to say? We're going to keep this secret and you're going to do it right now. What ace is beginnings, no matter what it is. And wands are like the spark. They're the fire. They are fast. So as soon as they concocted this plan, they, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So like, then we have temperance. Temperance in this deck is like, well, in all decks is duality. It's like, um, I mean, this girl is one foot on the land, one foot in the water. She's part woman, part angel. Then we have the world upside down. The world upside down is like the world comes crashing down. We have the tower. And the tower doesn't necessarily have to be... When I think of the tower, I think of 9-11. Like, towers tumbling down 
is not, um, it can be a change. It can be a good change. In this context, it's like, if you don't do this, I mean, you're fucked. So then we have another two of wands, two of wands in reverse. Anything two is choices, duality. We should see that with temperance. And then the seven of cups. So we have um, emotions, cups are emotions. Seven is like cunning strategy. So like anything with the seven is like the underlying like of sevens, the meaning of sevens, no matter what it is. I mean, I, I am speechless. I don't even have to read anymore. I'm glad that we tried this new tarot deck. Um, I almost want to take a picture of this. This is like poor one. I feel bad for her. This is like so much bigger than she expected, so much bigger than she wanted. So we have a duality shown twice. We have the seven is like also cunning, strategy, victory. They are going to tell you what you're going to do or your world's going to come clashing down. Oh, by the way, we made a deal with the devil because I don't, I'm not going to say who we are. You can come to your own conclusions on that because I've been watching tarot readers get flagged all day long, but <laughs> I am just stating what's on the cards. And then we have the moon, the moon are secrets. Then we have the ace of wands and that's like another choices, duality, fast acting. It's a balance, it's a reflection, reflection of the moon, secrets. Then we have temperance, she is straight up duality. Um, I mean, I can't even explain it better than the card does. Then we have the world upside down. That means like this poor woman, I feel so bad for her. She got on this plane, whatever happened, we can get to that because whatever happened was real. She believed it. She found herself almost in like uh, a deal that she doesn't, uh, it was big. It's so much bigger than her. And they made it pretty clear, like your world, as you know, it's over. And then we have the two of wands in reverse. So the two of wands, can you see this card? Um, um, okay. The two of wands in reverse, uh, another duality. And it's also another, like the one, oh my gosh, like the ones in reverse. I just feel so bad for her. Um, she had a choice. She got to do some reflecting. <laughs> yeah, right. The reflecting was, you're going to put out this statement right now, or we're going to turn your world upside down. And thanks for coming to the show. Like that's this poor woman. Um, okay. So we got the answer to that. Perfect. Thank you cards. I mean, I feel bad for her. I just feel really bad for the lady on the plane. I mean, think what you want. And I don't really have an opinion, but what I do have an opinion on is that was not her. Oh my gosh. Oh, I feel so bad. Um, all right. So, oh man, I don't even know what to ask. I have goosebumps. Um, what did she see on the plane? I've seen a few tarot readings that she saw. Oh my, that she saw, um, a shapeshifter that I don't know what she did see is was I don't know you guys probably everyone has their own opinion I think that she saw something that was very real to her it was very much her reality I did not watch the rest of the body cam footage because I don't believe any of it um she was coerced I'll tell you that right now um and it wasn't coercion like a nice offer it was like you're going to do this or else I mean, the only thing we could have gotten that would have been a little clearer would have been the death card. But I mean, ugh, this poor woman, I feel bad for her. Um, all right, these cards are good. I have to ask a question. All right, um, okay. What did she see on the plane? Let's just tap into the, I don't even want to call her a crazy lady on the plane. She's not crazy. What did the woman on the plane?